net of a cube. Moving on in this section, we shall be calculating the net of a cube, and we do recall that a cube has six equal faces, and each face is a square. When it is being flattened out, as you can see, we have six squares to form a cube. To calculate the surface area of a cube, we are to remember that a cube is made up of six squares, and the total surface area will equal the sum of the area of all the squares. The formula to calculate the area of a square is length multiplied by length, which will give us L square. Now, the surface area of a cube will be the sum of the area of all the squares. That is, your square AB down to F. All the areas of each square, when summed up, will give us the surface area of a cube, which can then be simplified as 6 multiplied by L squared, which is the same as 6L squared. Let us take a look at this example, where we are required to find the surface area of a cube with depth 4 centimeters. Take note, depth is 4 centimeters. The first thing to do is to calculate the area of our square, which is L square. This will be 4 multiplied by 4, and this will give us 16. Therefore, the surface area of the square will be 6 multiplied by 16, which will give us 96 centimeters square. Let's consider a second example. Find the total surface area of a cube if the length is 7 centimeters. Let's recall that the total surface area of a cube is 6L square. This will mean we are to multiply 6 by 7 by 7. Simplifying this, we will get 6 multiplied by 49 because 7 multiplied by 7 gives 49. Working further, 6 multiplied by 49 will give us 294 centimeters square. Therefore, the total surface area of our cube with length 7 centimeters is 294 centimeters square.